going to do Randy Santel's brand new $20 value menu challenge featuring Carl's Jr. Uh, their $1.50 sliders. He actually got it for $1.25 each. I don't know, for my area, these cost $1.50, so it's actually $24 instead of $20, but that's okay. So it's going to be 16 of these double cheeseburger slider thingies. Uh, new only at happy hour. Like they, the discounted price is during happy hour from 2 to 5. So you want to get at a discounted price, head on over to that time. But let me set it down this way. Because it was starting to fall over. I was only leaving it like that for the picture. But these look so cute. I don't think I ever had Carl's Jr. before because there's not many near me. So this will be interesting. This will be interesting. And I am in front of Starbucks. So I got some tea and some water. And on the side I got some ranch to help me put it down. Let me put some hair real quick and we will get started. Centel's $20 value challenge across the unit. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Okay guys, so this is another uh, Randy Santel's $20 value menu challenge. I am <laughs> outside of Starbucks actually because um, I like Starbucks. You know, they give you a uh, refill. On, actually, I just figured it out when I came to this Starbucks. They actually give me a refill on the tea and they give me free water and there's free Wi-Fi. So it's a, it's a perfect hangout spot and on my tour, it's like my chill spot because, you know, it's it's you know you could just hang out here till I got something else to do but anyway we are here doing Randy's challenge um, this is from Carl's Jr. and from the happy hour 2 to 5 they sell these sliders for $1.50 where I am you know uh, where Randy is apparently is $1.25 so it cost it $24 for me and $20 for him but that's whatever so it's 16 sliders that I have to beat Randy in I don't know what his time is I'm gonna be releasing the video the same time he is and um, it's funny because throughout this video you see the lighting kind of go down a little bit and I had to adjust the lighting and um a little bit through the video because the sun was setting and whatnot but yeah um so like i said i've never had carl's jr today um i never had carl's jr and this is my first time trying it and i did not like it uh, maybe it's because i let it sit too long because i was taking pictures but the burger was really really dry um the the bun was dry, the patty was dry, and I, I didn't think I would have had, had to even use the ranch, but I wish I gotten, had gotten more liquid because I drank through the tea and the water both pretty fast, so I was kind of like rationing it out because I didn't want to go back in, waste some time, and come back out. Um, but yeah, I was just, I was trying to eat it as fast as I can. And uh, I smushed it together to kind of reduce the chewing because, like, it was so dry. Um, if I ate it in individually, it would have to, um, it would, it, it, you know, it, it would just take too much time. So I smushed it together a little bit. So it kind of be like eating one huge burger instead of two small dry burgers. So I don't know if that helps. That's just one of the strats I do. I like just to smush everything together without getting super gross, but you know, just reduce, minimize the chewing because um, th when I eat dry food and it doesn't go down easily, my jaw does get very tired. So yeah, that's that. And um, I don't know, if you guys want to try out Randy's um, $20 value challenge, go for it. He's got a whole bunch of different stuff, McDonald's, Wendy's, Sonic. You know, I haven't done all of them because I don't even know where there's a Sonic. And you know, one, I guess one cool thing about doing all these Randy challenges is I go to all these fast food uh, places that I never usually go to. Like, because of Randy, I've had Taco Bell for the first time, I had Wendy's for the first time, um, I had Carl's Jr. for the first time. Um, yeah, I don't know if that's a good thing, but I, the only fast food I really ate growing up was In-N-Out and McDonald's and Del Taco. That's about it. 
I rarely got anything else because you know Asian parents are like oh no it's the fast food it's bad for you so <laughs> I usually just eat a whole bunch of veggies at home and I grew up eating a lot of Asian food uh, that's why burgers are hard for me because I did not grow up eating burgers and um, burgers are just ground beef and is like usually very dry and and I really like a lot of veggies I when when I do eat normally at home I can't just eat straight up meat like that like I need to pair it with something so eating straight up meat for me is very hard because it's so salty and there's like no texture because I like veggies usually it's crunchy so it gives it like kind of like a light balance to the meat Eh, but that's my personal personal preference so yeah hope you guys enjoy this video I just like to uh, follow Randy whenever he does a $20 value menu challenge because you know it's fun it's fun to do and to support Randy. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Check out my social media, my Facebook page. Um, I do a lot of live streaming and on my Instagram page. I do a lot of giveaways and on my Twitter page. I also give a shout out to where I might be so you guys can kind of follow me on my journey, okay? And then check out my other videos. And again, make sure you subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.